All right, we are back. We are still in Auntie Ethel's creepy, creepy tea house. All right, what's next? Defeat the goblin, save the first year, seal the sacred idol. Don't know if I can do that. Destroy the ancient tome. We unlocked it. Uh. Okay. Find the crash, rescue Kels, and get help from Auntie Ethel. Yeah, she's not happy with us. Get help from Healer Nettie. All right. Not helpful there either. All right. So I guess there's not a whole lot to do. Finish the masterwork weapon. We need bark from a susser tree. Well, really. All right. Good luck with that. Don't know where we think we're getting that, but okay. Have we? Have you checked this wicker basket? Can you not get over here? Uh, this door is locked, eh? Uh, can you attack the door? Yes. Is Shillelagh a cantrip? It's a... Yeah. Lovely. Break this down faster, please. There we go. Great. Now you can get over here. Need to find a way forward. Potion of greater healing. I'll have that. Grilled Roth ribs. Yes, please. Wicca basket. We have a rotted cheese wedge. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna pass on that. Be perfectly honest with you. Alright, well that certainly was what there was to see here. I can't... What's out here? Have I ever looked out here? Unclear. Let's go exploring. Ribbit, ribbit. It's a frog. Addled frog, eh? Hold up, speak with animals. I have something to ask. Hag is gone! Happy! Indeed. Glad I could help. Happy! Happy! Come! Present! Yes, present? Follow you for present? Uh, does anyone else think that we're probably wandering into a trap? Oh, chest. Hold up. Money, I'll take that. Where are you off to? Alright, there's nothing in here. And nothing in there. Here! Shiny! Bye! Okay. Oh! Thing. Barbed bulrush. We got... Poisoned apples. Yeah, I don't really want poisoned apples. I gotta be honest with you. Pouch! There it is. Okay, yes. Ooh. Scroll of Shatter. Protection of good and evil. Speak with dead. A malachite and some gold. Well, that's nothing if not somewhat helpful. So, thanks for that, I guess. Uh, I think we're very done here. Here. Oh, dead red caps that we never bothered to loot. How interesting. Money! Appreciated. Alright, so we're done in the gnarled woods. We did the, the, uh, everything out here that we needed to do. Uh, journal. Carlac, really quickly. Uh, we have dealt with the Paladins of Tear. Right, okay. So next step could be the goblin camp. All right. So question. Um, Can't beat it. I mean, you could try gnolls and whatnot. We are what? We're level four. Yeah, I've got some thoughts on that. Carl like his resistance to fire, so that's nice. What other options do we have? Get to the goblin camp over there, yes. Um, go up the Risen Road. Find Zoru, which we have never done. That's funny to me. Alright, well, in that case... 
Uh, we should do... We should head up here. Alright, there's, uh... I haven't discovered this area yet. This is the Raphael spawn point. It's been so long since we've done a lot with this character, I honestly don't recall. Aha! Sup. Alright, well, anyway... Raphael's chatting. Call it a anyway... What's better? He's a devil. Am I he's a, a cambion. He's well, offering a little bit of help. Like... Take all the time. Alright, Gail and Shadowheart approve of me taking time to decide. Before you're counting down with tentacles. Whether I really want this guy to Try help to me. Try to cure yourself. Shop around. Hope. <laughs> Such a tease. That's what separates us from the devil, soldier. They think our greatest strength is a weakness. Noted. Anyway, alright. Uh... I've always wondered what a laughing mind flayer sounds like. You All might those just find out, my dude. Symptoms, sundering skin, dissolving guts, they haven't manifested yet, have they? One might say you're a paragon of luck. I'll be there when it runs out. Right. Lovely stuff. Uh, did somebody find this? Yeah, great. Uh, anybody got a shovel? I might have a shovel. I should have a shovel. Do I? I do. Great. Have at it. Alright. A little bit of hyena ears. Well, that's exciting. Yeah, we're running terribly long camp supplies. In fact, one of the things that we probably should do is run back to the grove really quickly and see if we can't buy a couple more Gail received condition arcane hunger well crap alright uh, we gotta decide what we're feeding him because I kind of like basically everything that we've got there's the moon drop pendant uh, there's also... Makes it easier for the wearer to succeed death saving throws. That... Or, hold up, the sparkle hands. This is an unarmed attack. Yeah, to be honest, uh, we don't have an unarmed character. So that one probably makes the most sense to feed him. Let's, let's go ahead and get rid of that. My condition likes being ignored as little as I do. I must consume another artifact. And soon. Right. Okay. Uh, so we've got the sparkle hands, which kind of sucks to hand that over, but all right, do it. Thanks. Thank you. I mean, it's blue and all the others are green, but it's one that I can feel comfortable parting with, so... Good gods. It hardly has any effect. Oh, Mr. Have mercy on us all. Listen, I need to speak to you, to all of you. Oh, hey, we're Be having this. of me to remain silent. All right, yes. Um, you're among friends. I might just be about to remedy that. I don't know about that, man. You have to know who I was. You have to know who I really am. Are you someone who can solve my tadpole problem? Is a walking shadow of the promise I once held. And what one might call a wizard prodigy. Who from an early age could not only control the weave, but compose it. Much like a musician or a poet. Such was my skill that it earned me the attention of the mother of magic herself. The lady of mysteries. The goddess Mistra. She oh. revealed herself to me and she became my teacher. In time she became my muse. And later even my lover. Alright, you made love to a goddess. Congratulations. Oh, yes. We enjoyed each other's company. Body, mind, and soul. But even so, I desired more. You see, no matter how powerful a wizard we mortals can become, 
We never scratch more than the surface of the weave. Mistra keeps us in check. There are boundaries she doesn't let us cross. Yet, every time I was with her, I stood on the precipice, gazing into the wonders that lay beyond. I sought to cross her boundaries. Yeah, I'm guessing she didn't like that. Anyway, yeah. You stuck a magic bomb in your chest. And God says it ever hungry. Yes. Thankfully, the moment I absorbed the fragment wasn't enough to kill me outright. Your hand is clipping through mine. Your hand is really clipping through mine. This netherese blight, this orb, for lack of a better word, is balled up inside my chest. And it needs to be fed. Right. As long as I absorb We've traces been working of the on that. from... It must feel like a betrayal. That is... You truly are a soul that steals my own. From all my new rallied heart, I thank you. Uh, what is that thank noise? I understand if you stand against... St no. Gail? Gail, something interesting with... Was that just the poor calls coming back down finally? That was... Or was that the, uh, the sound effects of me touching the, the magic bomb in his chest finally catching up? Could be either one, really. Fairy fire. Oh, I have this because I'm a drow. Right, yes, it's a charisma. Which, unfortunately for me, uh, my charisma's not terrible. Alright, Aaron. Well met. Is there anything you need? I lower my prices for fellow druid. That's Just fantastic. No uh, I'm so glad to hear that you lower your prices for fellow druid. Gloves and missile snaring. Yeah, alright. Don't really need that. Alright, we should get rid of some stuff. Not the broken spear, but like short bows. Uh, these twisting branches I don't need. I got something better. All this leather armor that we're hauling around. The club. The quater staff. The other quater staff. Uh, do you think we should sell these? I don't know. I don't know. I'm worried that they have like a negative side effect that we don't really want to find out about. Um, Carl, like studded leather armor. We can sell that. We can sell these freaking masks. All right, we got more studded leather armor here, including a war hammer, uh, leather gloves, those can go. A mug, how exciting. Quater staff, sword, a couple javelins. Oh, hey, there's the morning star. That uh, Shadowheart needs to have that. All right. Made some money off of that. I'm always happy about that. Uh, while we're here, Damon's down in one of these places, I believe. That's certainly a way to come down. Some hill giant strength. There's just stuff from Ani Ethel's uh, stall just left here, which I appreciate. Damon, yo. Thought I sensed an inferno around here. But you aren't from Eltarell. What's your story? Infernal Spoken engine in her heart. The devils were delighted when your city was swallowed up. I thought they had you for keeps. Glad you got out. I got lucky. It looks like you did too. And you brought some infernal machinery with you. A little gift from Zariel. Keeps me burning hot. Very hot by the smell of it. Might be burning out a piston ring. Be my guy. So, anyway, I might be able to help. That thing infernal iron. I worry about surviving the night first, but help one, help both. If we can cool you off, it'll stabilize your engine and allow you to touch whomever you please. Right. Great. All right. Um, where should we look? I've Didn't we some have some already? It has a meanwhile. I've still got plenty of I thought I had infernal iron, but I guess not. Alright, we've got a morning star plus one that we could hand over to Shadowheart. Uh hand crossbow plus one. I'm not proficient with 
any ranged weapons, which is really, really bad for me. Uh, that's something I gotta work on. Helmet, leather helmet, not terribly important. Uh, hunting short bow with the hunter's mark. Yeah, okay, whatever. Quater staff plus one. Now, I don't think there's really anything terribly interesting here for us. All right. Forged from the hunt. Uh, so, dumb question. You'll need infernal iron. Yeah, show on map. Where can I find some of that? Doesn't say. Ooh, there's infernal iron in the blighted village. Great. That should be our next step. But first, uh, last time we leveled up Will, and then we reloaded an old save, and as a result, Will was not leveled up. So I want to, I want to throw this guy back in my party. Yep, yep. As long as they're leaving, join me, please. To join, but uh, Gail's going to take a I rest. Like and then Will gets to level needed. up. And I forgot what we gave him as the spell, but I'm sure that as soon as I see this... Okay, for cantrips, I think we went with Minor Illusion, uh, which I guess we'll do. Bone Chill. Ooh, Undead Target. Yeah, there aren't that many Undead Targets as the thing. So I just do Minor Illusion. For spells, we went with... What was it? It wasn't Enthrall, it wasn't Shatter, it might have been Blindness, although I kind of doubt it because I have Blindness. Frick it, just throw in Scorching Ray, that's useful to me, and then uh, Bump of his Charisma. <sighs> Works like a charm. Uh, the other thing we should do is, we, oh we can't summon Scratch, we're in camp, right, yes. Alright, cool. Um, now with this party, we're gonna go back to the Blighted Village and find some Infernal Iron. Pieces. These goblins aren't exactly house proud as occupiers go. And I can't find Scratch. Yeah. Place looks like it's been abandoned a good while. I'm not sure why I can't find Scratch, but whatever. Hey, maybe we can scare up a few dusty bottles of wine somewhere. All right, Infernal Iron. Oh, um. Let me guess, Gale had the Morning Star that we were going to give Shadowheart. Frig. Alright, don't worry about that right now. Then that's, that's not that big a deal. I still can't summon Scratch. Oh, oh! I can't summon Scratch because I only have the one ritual spell at a time. I bet. I bet that's what's going on. Well, there's an easy, there's an easy way around that. And that is to hand off Scratch's ball to... Shadowheart, who's always going to be in my party. And Shadowheart can go ahead and cast a ritual spell. <laughs> Sup, Scratch? All's well that ends. At least I, pres I presume that's what's happening. Alright. Uh, Blighted Village. Infernal Iron is back this way. Okay. Here we go. Uh, calcified web, you say. Target is too close. Okay, hold up. How's that? There we are. That's that web take care taken care of. Uh, if I were to jump down there, I'd lose an HP. Okay. Uh, the shabby wooden doors. There's a. What's this? Use. Okay. Why don't you come out, then? Unclear. Can I just come in here? Oh! What do I know? Alright. I've been in here. We found the plans for the... super weapon. I need to find infernal iron somewhere in here. Torch, wooden chest, hand axe javelin, some thieves tools... A morning star. Shadowheart. Shadowheart, I just found a new toy for you. Wherever that might have ended up. There it is. There you go. Uh, torch, torch. 
Short sword, short sword. What's this? Uh oh. Oh, this is a back door into the spider pit. Right, 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 right. Yes. Okay. But that's not actually what I'm looking for. Alright. Supposed to be Infernal Iron somewhere over here. Let's split the party and have best girl take a flying leap up here. It says it's beneath me. Wooden chest is locked. Okay. I mean, I guess you could try lockpicking it. But, uh, well, gloves of power. Slate of hand plus one. Alright, get some bonuses. Maybe you can pull this off. Nope. Alright, well, we got plenty of uh, inspiration rolls. Nope. At some point, there we go. Critical success. Thanks. All right, in here we got, ooh, a steel forged sword. It's not as good, unfortunately. But what's this? That's Infernal Iron. Infernal Blacksmith's Infernal note. Yes, yes it can. Great. Pop back down. Put the band back together. We can go back to the grove. Uh, metal, silver, underdark, gift, faintly sulfuric order. Forging unsuccessful. All right. He knows a little bit about the Infernal Iron. A little bit. So what happened to the other sword? If we killed the Paladins, we should have looted Justice. Maybe we sold it. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess that's that's a possibility. We might have sold it. How fast the search? We found some. Please let this work. Mmm. The weight of it. And that blaze of chaos. Can't imagine this where my heart should be. Uh-huh. Must be quite the experience. Uh-huh. Give me just a moment. <sighs> yeah, I'll show you this cutscene because we tend to, like, skip this. We, we found a coin. Like, every time we've played this, we find a coin in Withers' tomb, and I kept thinking that was Infernal Iron. There. So I never bothered looking you more and actually afraid. advancing Carlax quest in Act One. In all, kind of all right, so did she just like take her top off in front of us, or how is she installing it? That feels good. I'm still burning hot as hell's hole, but I feel less. Changeable. Cheers, mate. Pleasure. And as for the heat, I haven't got any solutions now, but I'm not giving up. Could be if the combustion chamber had its own insulation, or if we had some kind of enchanted coolant. Find me again in Baldur's Gate. If I'm worth my salt, I'll have figured something out by then. Take All right. Care, Karlak. And hopefully the next time I see you, I'll have something promising to report. Pocket any infernal iron you find along the way. Hmm? Good luck with that. Oh, and we get another chitty chat with Carlac, but she can't talk to herself, so I need to bring back Tarnt for a second. In it. Damon's upgrade didn't cool me down, but it did juice me up. I don't think I've ever felt more powerful. Right. That's good. Let's uh, find some evil for you to smack. Bring it on. All right, she's all set. Lovely stuff. Alright. A little shorter episode, but that's alright. We actually advanced a quest that we often forget about in these playthroughs. So that's where we're going to go ahead and leave this one. Uh, thank you very much for watching. And until next time, goodbye. Did you steal Minthara's underwear?
<laughs> you monster! Whoopsie! That was fun. Why is my intimidate so high anyway? Because I have high intelligence. Oh. It's a, it's a nice night out, huh? I scare people with my brain.